Do you know? What are the evidences which suggest that all living beings are originated from a common ancestor? Let's talk about it. The hypothesis that all modern living beings originated from a common ancestor is one of the strongest foundations of biology and evolutionary theory. It is supported by multiple independent lines of evidence from molecular biology, genetics, biochemistry, embryology, paleontology, and comparative anatomy. I'll give you a complete, step-by-step -step explanation of the evidences. Evidences for common ancestry of all life. Number 1. Universal genetic code. All organisms, from bacteria to humans, use the same DNA-RNA system to store genetic information. The genetic code, triplet codons for amino acids, is nearly universal. AUG codes for methionine start in almost all organisms. UGA, UAG, UAA are stop codons universally. If life arose independently many times, we would expect different coding systems. This strongly suggests a single origin of life. Number 2. Similarity in fundamental biochemistry. Same 20 amino acids out of thousands possible are used to make proteins in all living beings. Same chirality of molecules. Proteins use only L amino acids. Nucleic acids use D sugars. Same ATP is used as the universal energy currency. Same metabolic pathways like glycolysis and Krebs cycle are shared across all domains of life. This biochemical unity is best explained by descent from a common ancestor. Number 3. Conservation of cellular structures. All cells, prokaryotic and eukaryotic, are enclosed by a lipid bilayer membrane. DNA replication, transcription and translation follow the same basic mechanisms using enzymes like DNA polymerase, RNA polymerase and ribosomes. Ribosomes in bacteria, archaea and eukaryotes are structurally similar, though with variations. Shared cell structures show a common cellular origin. Number 4. Homologous genes and proteins. Comparative genomics reveals that many genes are conserved across species, like cytochrome C found in almost all aerobic organisms. The closer two species are, the more similar their DNA sequences. Example, Hox genes that control body plan development exist in fruit flies, mice and humans. Genetic similarity supports shared ancestry. Number 5. Fossil record. Fossils show transitional forms linking different groups. Examples include Archaeopteryx between reptiles and birds, and Tiktaalik between fish and amphibians. The earliest microfossils, 3.5 to 3.8 billion years old, resemble bacteria. No fossil evidence suggests multiple independent origins of life. Instead, all lineages trace back to microbial ancestors. Fossils demonstrate gradual evolution from a common root. Number 6. Comparative anatomy and morphology. Homologous structures, similar structures with different functions, suggest descent with modification. Example, four limbs of humans, cats, whales, and bats show the same bone arrangement but different functions. Vestigial organs like human appendix and whale pelvis indicate evolutionary remnants of common ancestors. Morphological similarities reveal evolutionary links. Number 7. Embryological evidence. Early embryonic stages of vertebrates, fish, birds, mammals, are strikingly similar. Features like pharyngeal pouches, tails, and gill slits appear in embryos of different vertebrates. This suggests shared developmental pathways inherited from a common ancestor. Number 8. Molecular phylogenetics. Comparing DNA, RNA, and protein sequences allows construction of phylogenetic trees. These trees consistently trace back to a single root, LUCA, the last universal common ancestor. Example. RNA gene sequences are used to classify all life into bacteria, archaea, and eukarya. Molecular clocks confirm common descent. Number 9. Geographical distribution. Related species are often found in the same geographical regions. Example. Darwin's finches in Galapagos evolved from a common ancestor but adapted to different niches. This supports descent from common ancestors followed by diversification. Number 10. Experimental evidence. Laboratory experiments show evolution in action. E. coli long-term evolution experiment by Richard Lenski shows accumulation of mutations leading to new traits. Artificial selection like dog breeds and crop domestication demonstrates how diversity arises from common stock. Concept of LUCA, last universal common ancestor. Estimated to have lived 3.5 to 3.8 billion years ago, likely a single-celled simple organism. It had DNA as genetic material, RNA and ribosomes for protein synthesis, ATP as energy currency, and a cell membrane. LUCA gave rise to bacteria, archaea, and eukarya. Conclusion All these independent lines of evidence, 
genetic code, biochemical pathways, conserved structures, homologous genes, fossil record, embryology, molecular phylogenetics, converge to confirm that all living beings originated from a single common ancestor, LUCA. This is why biologists universally accept common descent as the most robust scientific explanation for the diversity of life. Nature is ultimate, like, share and subscribe.